Hi boys and girls, I am so excited because today we are going to be looking at the other spellings for the long E. We have learned if you have an E consonant E or any vowel consonant E, that E reaches over, pinches the first one and makes it yell its name. In this case, it would be E. But today you're gonna see that the E E and the E A can also make the E sound. So let's start by reviewing our short E words. First word. Right, peg, peg. Sometimes I'll use a peg when they're building furniture, peg. Jed. Now this is a person's name I know because it starts with a capital J, Jed. Very good. Do you remember the SH is a quiet brother? Sh shed. Excellent. We got the blend SL. Sled. Like you're riding a sled down a snowy hill. N. Min. Didn't quite have the eh sound. Min. So let's take the apostrophe S off. Let. Let's. That apostrophe S lets you know this is a contraction for the word let us. Let's is a contraction for let us. The apostrophe is showing a U is missing when it's put into one word. So this would be like, let us swim, please. Let's swim, please. Pen, I write with my pen. Are you reading it before I can say it? Good job. Make sure you're using all parts of your brain. You're writing it. You're reading it. You're saying it. All parts of your brain. Yelled. If I take off the suffix, I get my root word of yell. And I know ed can make one of three sounds. Ed, d, or t, yelled. That time it made a d sound. Nest. Excellent. All right, so these are our short E's. These all have the E. Eh. Mim was a little bit different. It more sounded more like an I, but all these are my short E words. Let's look at our first spelling of long E, and there's not very many. There's not very many of these. This one is the word peaked. Very good. And it goes with that E consonant E. E consonant E. There's not very many E consonant E words out there. Peat. That is the first way to get the E sound. The next one is the E double E. So we're going to be doing this one right now with two E's. And the chant is E double E always says E. So when you see two E's, you know it says E. First word. This is going to make a swa. A. Uh, asleep. Excellent. Next word. Street. Excellent. Need. Wow, you were fast on need. Need. I need you to practice hard. Green. You have that blend. Grr. Like the dog growling. Grr. Sweet. 
sweet. Sw, sw. You have an S and then a W sound. Sw at the beginning. It's a blend. Cheese. Cheese. You see two E's right there. Remember, E E says E. E double E always says E. Beets. Very good. This is like the food that you would eat. It's a reddish food that you could eat out of the vegetable. Beets. Steep. Like a, a steep mountain. Now this one, this mountain is not steep. This one where it goes almost straight up, that one is steep. Take off the suffix. Cheer. And put the suffix. Full. Cheerful. Jeep. Excellent. Sheep. This one has a longer blend at the beginning. Has a has the nasty brother and then an R. Thur. Thur. E. Three. Like the number three. Tree. Very good. So this is the E E says E. You can always rewatch the video if you need more practice. Now we're going to practice this last spelling of E A. Meat. Seat. Ooh. S eat. M eat. They rhyme. B beans. That E A says E. Beans. That C H is going to go ch. Beach. Let's take off the suffix. Er, each, reached, reached. Excellent job, boys and girls. So just remember, you have three spellings. You have the E, constant E, like in Pete. You have the E, E, like in sweet. And you have the E, A, like in beach. They all say E. Now, the last two I'm going to show you are exceptions to the rule. We have the word great, gr, eight. For that E-A, it's going to make an A sound. Great. And then we have headed. I'm going to take this suffix off for a minute. Ed. That E-A makes an E sound. Headed. Headed. So, mostly your EA is going to make an E sound, but no, there are a few exceptions in English. Have a great day, boys and girls, and we'll see you again soon.